Alright guys, I'm back recording part three of Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. I think I found what you wanted me to see. <laughs> Sounds like you did. We'll be waiting. Please not go back to the ship. My friend, it appears the Sefo had some interest in Dathomir. It's strange for such a peaceful culture to have any sort of fascination with a place so dark. The dark place. Should be a lot quicker than the way in. I can't take this, can I? Alright, looks like I can't. Smells worse than Grease does. Boggling was killed. Was it trying to defend its family? Thank you. 
You passed the test. So you knew about BD-1? Come on board. We'll talk inside. Oh, BD-1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? Get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! Get out of there! Get out! That is BD-1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil stains out of Batoli weed fabric? Not really. Oh, I hope you found something better out there than this droid. Oh, calm down, Breeze. He did. Tell us, Cal. The vault was built by an ancient civilization called the Zepho. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? A holocron from the archives. It contains a list of Force-sensitive children. The next generation of Jedi. I knew it! Ah, oh, Cordova, you old fool. Now we gotta you knew him? Over. Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was a loner. And that little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. A hollow what? A holocron. It stores information, but only accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. So basically a holograph, but just for Jedi. Use the Force. This is Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. I regret to report that both our Jedi Order and the Republic have fallen. With that list of Force sensitives, we could rebuild the Jedi Order and defeat the Empire. Okay, no problem. Let's get it! Well, except the Holocron is hidden deep inside the vault, and to get it, we have to follow Cordova's path. He mentioned something about the planet Dathomir and a Zepho homeworld. All right, well, where are we going? Now, I'm just asking because I was thinking of maybe making some food. Look. Before we do anything, I need to know something. How come you're no longer a Jedi? Yeah, she's retired. I had an experience that changed my perspective. So I cut myself off from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the Order is the best chance we have against the Empire. What do you believe? I wonder what kind of experience would have made her... Get rid of the force. I believe I can't keep hiding from the Empire, so I don't really have a choice. Cal, as long as you're alive, you will always have a choice. Are you with us? We're in. Death Mirror Zepho, it's your choice. Next, let's go to... So I get to pick where I go. I am here. So I can either go here or here. I only have one out of six secrets and two out of 16 chests here. So I might... I guess I'll have to come back after... I'll come back after like I beat the game and explore, I guess. But I'm gonna like continue through the main storyline. Main objectives over here, so. Search for Zeppo using the hollow table and then Mantis. Oh, if I do that. There's like nothing here. Yeah, my piloting hasn't been this good since I graduated first in my class at the Lateron Space Academy. I wasn't aware Lateron had an academy. Yeah, it was new back in the day. You probably don't get around that area much. So what did you train on? Name it. Fighters, freighters, short range, long range, whatever. I flew circles around air. Greece, what's this thing? What? You've never seen a terrarium before? Sure, but don't they usually have plants in them? Well, I've been a bit busy hauling you around the galaxy. But you know, you could pay me back with some seeds. I thought you hated nature. When it's out there, you bet you. Yeah, but when it's behind it's a comfortably it's thick it's wall of bar and glass, that's perfection. All right, I'll see if I can find any. It's starting to grow.
a storm brewing down there. This might not be the best time to land. Yeah, something strange. Those winds are interfering with our comms. Hey, Cordova mentioned something about peace in the eye of the storm. Well, I can just make out a settlement in the middle of it. Then we have to get there. Copy that. Couple bumps ain't gonna kill you, kid. <laughs> Unless the wind picks up. Can you tell that bucket of balls to keep his opinion to himself? I'm sure everything's under control. Because it's under control, it's just a little tricky. <laughs> Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh. Huh. Perfect landing. <laughs> Easy money, baby. Uh, but I'm still Easy getting a lot money. of interference on the comms. It's gonna take me a minute to get them back up. I'll search for signs of Cordova in the meantime. Good. I'll be in touch once I crack this. Cal, over here. You did good work on Pagano. The more information we gather on Cordova and the Zepho, the closer we'll get to stopping the Empire. Hang on. Hang on. I can see you two have been through a lot. It's not easy. Hang on. Watch out, BD. You don't look friendly. Cal, can you hear me? The Empire. They found Zepho. If they were following the Mantis, we would have been swarmed already. Could they be looking for the tombs? Let's hope not. Just got our comms working. I'll try the same workaround to crack into there.
way to kill those guys is just to fight the different bullets. At least if they're at that range. Let's go, BD1. Good job. wanted this land. Another one? Snare chest over here. Good job. Hey now. What do we find? New punch. Joe 
guys near here. Visca, get the target! Come back here. Something we can use? Watch it! Come on, don't let him get you. In the rotation since I left Pagano, I've uncovered more about the Cepho than I once believed possible.
I'm looking. Last time I I healed, like in the rest meditate area. Oh, this is kind of unfortunate. Oh, the, at least the lights are on, right? So I spawned back. Looks like I spawned back here, but I've already done everything. So yeah, see that chest is open. First dip. Appreciate it. That looks like a problem. still there. I should tend to these wounds. On the men. Your turn. Jedi, engage with caution. Not ready for this. Gotta be one of this FO. Guess we're on the right track, huh, BD? Oh, did I 
have to go through all of that too. Slow for a longer duration, so I'm gonna get that, especially since there's no uh, the other things coming. Push it. Seer, there's a transport ship leaving the Empire's base. I heard. They plan to bring Zepho artifacts to Coruscant. Does that mean? That the Emperor is interested in Zepho? Maybe. Nilger oh. was wounded, but he took out a trooper.
was in there. With the Emperor's will, we have occupied Zepho, redistributing its inhabitants. This planet has failed to yield significant data or relics for Project Augur. Its electromagnetic winds have rendered the bulk of our mining technology useless. Meanwhile, more stormtroopers lose their lives to dangerous fauna. We will not be able to fulfill our directive here. It is my recommendation that we disband the project and leave a token outpost to keep scavengers from stealing our technology. Got an intruder here! <laughs> Got it! Am I the only one that's gonna fight? Quick, take him down! Come on, you win, traitor! I knew I'd win! Save 
Find something?
I found something. What do they know? No mention of Cordova. I don't think the Empire knows he's been here. Then we have the advantage. For now. Interesting. We're on the right track. Something else over there, but I'm gonna scan this first. Can't get through. There's a storm up ahead. Something about it crippled the Empire's equipment. I can feel something pulling me there, beyond the storm. Follow it. Let the force. I'll do my best. Come here, PD-1. Huh, another one of these. I wonder if they connect. seen a storm do that before. Yeah, it's incredible.
I'm in the tomb. It's massive. And the Empire? No sign of them down here. What about Cordova? Still not sure what I'm supposed to find. He's a little... Eccentric? Tell me about it. But he wouldn't send us here for his amusement. Keep an open mind. Can I get some aid? Appreciate it. Hey, do you see that? Ugh. Check it out. First him. Patched up.
not just wind rippling through these chimes. Voices from the past.